Greg Clark does not seem any different from the average college student. He attends Towson University, where he majors in photography and is on the dean's list. Greg is a diligent worker and is fairly self-sufficient. I started knitting because I like to make things that I can use. So what is so unusual about Greg? Almost everything he owns was found in the trash. It is called dumpster diving, and Greg is not alone in his pursuits. Regular people all over the world search through both residential and commercial dumpsters, hoping to capitalize on the waste of others. But Greg does not find credit card numbers or passwords. Instead, he looks for tangible objects that can be used in a constructive manner. Perfectly good soap. Armed with a flashlight in hand, Greg tours from dumpster to dumpster, hunting for whatever useful belongings he may find. Sony disc van with the tape adapter and car adapter. Probably one of my best finds was from a Wendy's promotion, where if you get so many cups, you can turn them in for uh, plane tickets. And so a friend and I got around 11 round trip tickets, and I traded one for an electric bicycle, which I sold and bought a moped. It's pretty awesome. Though many question the sanitation of dumpster diving, Greg has no reservations. Some underwear in here. That's why I wear gloves. From the food he eats to the clothes on his back, nearly all his possessions were salvaged from the garbage. Yeah, my cat was, uh, he was living under a dumpster. My girlfriend found him. It's a glass chest set. But Greg does not simply consume the waste of others, he improves upon it. I'd say about half the things I find are working condition, other half maybe need a little work. All it needed was a little duct tape. Works perfectly. So I found this chest full of some uh, audiobooks, so I took it and uh, it was sitting in my room for a while. I was trying to think of something to do with it, so I ended up making it into a garden. I put the light in and lined it with some trash bags to keep the water from soaking through. I even found the soil in a dumpster. The plants are still coming in, but I think they're going to come in well. It is widely known that one man's trash is another man's treasure. We, we like to get the everything bagels. Those are our favorite. Greg Clark brings new life to an old adage. Yeah, I cook for my roommates all the time. <laughs> 